All right, belly room, you having a good night tonight or what? Yeah. All right, enough about you, let's talk about me. My name is Noah Shark Robertson, and the question I get asked all the time is, why do they call you Shark? I guess it's a valid question, you know? It always makes me feel really bad that I don't have some badass story to tell, you know? And I just imagine myself with like an eye patch, a huge scar on my arm, a big cigar, and I'm like, you want to know why they call me the Shark? You're going to want to sit down for this, kid. But no, I don't have a cool story as to why I'm called Shark. Actually, when people ask me that, I'm normally just like kicking a rock like, I like sharks. <laughs> they're, they're cool. <laughs> and uh, what I always dread is the follow-up question. And I get it every time. Like once we've established I'm called Shark, I like sharks, everyone's always like, why do you like sharks so much? And maybe I'm biased, but I kind of thought it was like self-explanatory. <laughs> like sharks are badass. Like, I can understand if my name was Noah Duckbill Platypus Robertson. You know? Like, that would elicit some kind of, like, explanation. <laughs> and as you could have probably guessed, one of my bucket list items is, uh, I want to see a great white shark before I die. I just don't want to see a great white shark right before I die. You know? it, sounds like, it seems like it would be bad news. <laughs> and uh, everybody that knows me knows I'm super into sharks. So if it did happen, there's going to be a bunch of annoying bastards running around, like, well, at least he died doing what he loved. <laughs> what the fuck? Why do people say that? Like, people say that about Dale Earnhardt, the race car driver, you know? Well, at least he died doing what he loved. Yeah, burning in a fiery rage. Yeah. <laughs> this is awesome! I feel like a good example in this scenario would be uh, uh, Steve Irwin. Remember, he died from the rage, stabbing his heart. Like, come on, Danny, this is incredible! You know, like, he died doing what he loved. Uh, anybody here seen the movie Jaws? Yeah. Dude, best movie ever made in my opinion. Love Jaws. And uh, I really wish I was the guy that made the movie Jaws. Because then I might have a cool story as to why my name's Jaws, or Shark. <clears throat> but also, I would be filthy fucking rich. 500 million dollars that movie made. Like, even if I was the guy that made the soundtrack to Jaws, I would still be filthy fucking rich. And I have a funny story about that soundtrack. Uh, the, the Jaws theme, one of the most famous movie themes in history, almost didn't get made. This is a true story, swear to God, you can look it up. Whenever John Williams presented the final product to Steven Spielberg, uh, Spielberg thought it was a joke. Like he didn't believe it was real. Can you imagine that meeting whenever they sit down and he's like, all right, all right, I got the theme song, you ready? He hits play, dun, dun. Come on, man, Where, where's the real theme? This isn't funny, you know? Just wait, just wait, it gets better. Dun, dun. <laughs> John, we paid you hundreds of thousands of dollars. Where's the real thing? So, like, he's, he's sweating. Just wait. The best part's coming up. Here it comes. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, okay. I see where you're going with that. Genius. Brilliant. <laughs> so this guy gets in my car the other day. He sees all my shark tattoos. And he's like, hey, man. You ever seen the movie Jaws? <laughs> yes. Best movie ever made, in my opinion. And, uh... He's like, hey, uh, you ever seen the movie Jaws Backwards, man? <laughs> no, I can't say that I have. <clears throat> if you watch Jaws Backwards, it's about a shark that throws up so many people, they're forced to open a beach. <laughs> I'm like, what the fuck? Who is watching movies backwards? Like, who the hell is watching movies backwards? Where did you get this alien technology? How high are you that you're watching movies backwards? I just turned to the guy and I go, you're going to need a bigger joke. All right. My name is Jonathan.